Good morning, ladies and gentlemen. Uh, it is a beautiful Saturday morning here in Austin, Texas. This is day 872 of the three plus minutes of playing challenge. And as always, I am filled with gratitude. Thoughts on my mind this morning. This morning when I woke up, um, just as about, I was about to do my devotionals, um, a good friend of mine, Laura, came to mind. Um, she had recently lost her father just a few days ago. And um, just from our conversations, I've always known how close she is to her father, how much her father touched her. Um, uh, Laura lives in Prague. And uh, part of the reason why I'm explaining that is also Laura used to work with me at um, my company in JetBlue. And um, she left after 20 something, I think 20 something years or so. And I remember thinking at the time, like how could she do that? Like, like and she was following her dreams and, and things of the sort. And I was so inspired by it. I was so fearful for her. But there was something about it that drew me to it. And as I was going on my journey, um, I would watch her. Like I just would watch her from afar. And then a few years back, I can't remember exactly when she reached out to me. And she was so instrumental in my thinking. Uh, <laughs> she said this earlier, we were we are kindred spirits. And um, I could tell you, I was feeling her pain, um, her pain of loss. I know what it feels like, man. And um, I just wanted her to know that I was thinking of her. Um, I was sending out my love. I was hoping that I would dare so I could be able to hug her. It's always the concept of iron sharpening iron to make us better. She has been one of my irons. And so I am thankful for her. And when I speak of gratitude, she is someone that I'm truly grateful for. So Laura, I just wanted to let you know that you are on my heart, you are in my soul, I'm sending my love, and I'm so, so, so sorry for your loss. Love you. As always, ladies and gents, be blessed today and every day. Talk to you soon. Peace.